What is up, YouTube? Good morning, everyone. Welcome to another day in the life of Krishan, myself. And today's video will be a little different because a lot of times when I feel the day in the life, it's been in the office. It's always been in the office, actually. But this time will be a little different because I'm filming a day in my life as a remote developer. If you do not know, as you can tell, I'm not in a house. I'm in a hotel room right now. I'm at a Marriott in Tennessee. I did move here literally just a few weeks ago. So now I'm finally here, dudes. And I'm working remote as a remote developer. And as you can tell, like, check this out, man. That's my monitor that I brought. There's my iPad right there and my laptop. Oh my gosh, my laptop right there. And because I have that awesome HHKB wireless keyboard and this trackpad, I'm able to do everything I need. Like literally, oh, this is a really nice picture for Instagram. This is everything that I need. That is really, literally it. So this is probably going to be a really short video. I'm thinking like five, not seven minutes because really there's not much to do or there's not much to show you in coding other than my meetings and etc. like that. So anyway, man, here's my hotel room. So here's my hotel room. There's Tofu Girl. She's trying to take the bone. Are you trying to get that bone on there? Bro, that's not for you. That's for Oki. Oh my, you jacked it. You actually jacked it. Are you for real, dude? Okay. And then here's Oki. Oki, okay, hey, handsome. Psh, dude, I'm trying to show you off to YouTube. Are you rejecting me right now? Okay, whatever. So I want to show you guys my room. So again, this is my office. Not my office, but this is my hotel room. Yeah, and I mean, this is it, man. This is my view outside. Let me see if I can lower this. So I'm on the first floor because that's where dogs are put. But this is my view. Look at that tree. That's a beautiful view. But whatever man anyway so that's my room guys so let me go to work i'm about to have a meeting in about two minutes so let's go ahead and start with that All right, guys, so I just received a text message right now, and they sent me a picture of something, and the picture had 12 boxes of products that just arrived today. I'm really excited, man. I'm gonna tell you what it is. I hope you get excited as well. So let's go ahead and head to the farm right now, and let's go check out the boxes real quick. Let's go. Now that I'm looking back, I can see all the signs I tried to fill. I am here at the office right now, which is still being fixed at the moment, but there's something that I want to show you guys while I'm here. I just got a call from my friend Nathan and he told me all of my desk pads arrived today. Check this out, man. So these are the desk pads right here. Check it out. All these desk pads, all of them will be going on sale very soon. There is no one else who can stand by my side Oh why? So that you are up on it for me and I'm for it baby For them here are yeah, these yardies They want to go down to us But you are fat and vanlig And that you are laying on my team Alright guys, so this is my office man This is my, my house This is my, this is where I spend a majority of my day probably 16 18 hours a day if i'm not going to the gym if i'm not walking my dogs and doing errands and stuff this is where i begin working and this is where my dogs are at that's why they're making noises hey stop <laughs> but anyway man so i actually have two kind of desks so i have a desk for my actual job and i have a desk for my actual business this particular desk that i'm working on right now is for when i'm actually coding for the startup that i work at and the desk behind me is for when i'm building my business developer branded when I'm editing videos, when I'm speaking with my own clients, and etc. And the reason I have two different desks is because it just helps me focus. That when I'm here, sitting at this angle, facing this side of the wall, I need to focus on getting things done for the startup that I work at. Then when I'm back there, that's when I need to focus on making my videos. That's when I need to focus on building that new website for my new my company. And when I'm speaking with my team, with my employees and everything. So that's what I use that desk for. But anyway, man, so what I usually do every single day when I start work is that I'm here. I sit here and the first thing I do is I'm always looking at emails, but not even just emails because it's not something that emails going in and out yet. I'm looking at our, our chat that we have, we have Microsoft Teams, and I'm use that to communicate with you. So that's the first thing I look at, is any messages I miss, anything urgent, and that's the first thing that I do every single morning.
as you can probably tell, man, uh, coding does not look fun. <laughs> you're staring at a screen, you're typing all of these different words, these letters, symbols, and everything inside of your text editor, and you're hoping that it looks right on your browser, it looks exactly what you need to look like. Even though it looks like it's boring when you're watching it, to be honest, man, coding for me feels just like a video game. All I do every day is code. But even more than that, more than half of my day, other than just creating this web app that I need to do, I'm actually solving bugs. Why is something not displaying correctly? Why are we getting errors on our console, etc.? These are a lot of things that I do every single day. Particularly in the morning, <laughs> those are the first things that I look out for because those tend to be the things that take so much time, but not even just time. Those are the things that actually take so much brain power just to try to solve and fix something that you didn't realize was there. So this is pretty much exactly what my setup is, man. So here you go. This is my desk setup. I do have an HHKB wireless happy hacking keyboard. Amazing, but the battery died and I didn't have spare batteries. This has lasted me six months, which is amazing. So I'm waiting to, for the batteries to come in. Um, other than that, what I'm using right now is my MacBook Pro. By the way, when it comes to coding, when it comes to anything that I do, when it comes to code, when it comes to design, I personally prefer using a MacBook. But when it comes to video editing, <laughs> when it comes to playing video games, when it comes to everything else other than coding, other than hacking, I use my PC. All right, guys, so I just want to show you my setup really quick, man. This is my setup. So I'm using a 2019 15-inch Mac Pro. This was provided to me by my last company, Entrepreneur.com. When they laid me off, they let me keep it. Really nice of them. Uh, so this is my setup, man. I do use, again, does my happy hacking keyboard, and I know one, two, three sodas. I know, hey, I'm eating actually really healthy now, but those sodas, these Diet Coke, this Diet Coke is my weakness. And if you're looking at this, man, this is not what you think it is. These are just lens cleaners, all right? That's it. But anyway, man, so when it comes to coding, I don't need much. <laughs> I need a keyboard, I need a trackpad. I don't like using regular mouses for coding. And a lot of times, so this is my iPad. This is where I usually like play my music and etc. Like a lot of times, for example, I'll have a lot of times I'll have like my note section on my terminal here. It's just nice to have that as a second monitor. This laptop is usually closed. It's always closed. It's usually back there where my other camera is at. Other than that, man, when it comes to coding, I need a wide monitor. It just, it makes everything easier. So this is my ultra wide 34 inch Alienware 120 Hertz gaming monitor. I use this just for coding, not even gaming. I prefer monitors with a high refresh rate because it's just easier to code. It's just easier in the eyes, at least for me, man. And the text editor that I'm using is not Visual Studio Code. When it comes to working on stuff for the office, I'm using Coda 2 and a new actual app just came out. So I'm gonna buy the next editor that came out. It's like a hundred bucks. I, 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 it's my preference. But anyway, man, that is my setup when it comes to coding. Okay, boy, what's up, bro? What's up, good dog? What's up, bro? Uh, can you like, um, give me space? Like, I, I need to like, you know, squeeze in here. Can you like, get out of the way, please? Please? Actually, one last thing, man. <laughs> so, again, this is my setup, my cubbies and, and everything. Um, So my dogs are with me, so I had to make my setup. Now, it's still a mess, because I just moved here, but I had to make my setup where my dog can be comfortable. They got a huge, really comfortable bed, by the way, right there. Then for my small dog, what the heck? What did they? Tofa girl, Tofa girl, where are you? Tofa girl, what are you doing, bro? Bro, what do you think you're doing, huh? Where'd you get this from? Where'd you get this from, huh? Tell me, can you tell me, huh? Where'd you get this from? Did you take this out from the trash, huh? Huh? Uh oh, she knows she's in trouble. She knows she's in trouble. It's okay. I still love you. Love you, dude. By the way, if you guys are wondering what is with this mess, man, I just moved in to this house, my first house ever, which is exciting. Perfect, because now my dogs have a lot of space. But one of the best things about having your own house and having your, your own large backyard now is because when I lived in an apartment, when I lived in an apartment, like dudes, like, I had to walk my dogs down three flights of stairs to just, and then walk five minutes away from my apartment to where the grass is so I can actually walk my dogs and then walk all the way back up. But now, when it comes to these dogs, all I gotta do is this. All I have to do is literally Walk outside, open my door, and literally just take them out. That's it. Okay, boy. Okay, boy, let's go. 
Come on. You ready to go on a walk? You ready to pee? You ready to pee, dog? You ready to pee, dog? You ready to pee? Okay, I feel like the whole YouTube world is judging me now. Oh well. All right, guys. So another reason why I love working from home is the fact that now I have my own kitchen, <laughs> right? But I, I don't have to go out and travel anymore. Like I don't have to drive 10, 20 minutes out, wait another 10 to 20 minutes for food. Like all my food is in my fridge right here. Everything I need is in this house. What's so one of the best reasons that I love about working from home, and then the fact that I work at a startup, it helps even that much more because, like Joe, I I never leave the house. I put in gas. I put gas in my car like a week ago, and it's still full. <laughs> so I need to leave the house more. Now, the reason that I'm actually working here from home actually today, I actually work at the office, but I'm working from home today because like there's just so much to get done. What, bro? What, bro? Leave me alone, okay, boy? Leave me alone, okay, boy? Okay, boy? Hi. So what's up, bro? So that's what I love about working from home. Like, yo, so much freedom, all right? Usually when I, li when I lived, in California, when I worked for my last job in person, it would take me 20, 30 minutes to get to the office, 20, 30 minutes to come back home, and I would still have to see my dogs during lunch, so I was driving so much, and now I barely drive at all. Bye. Bye. Bye, good boy. Bye, good boy. Bye, good boy. Oh my God. Ah! Bye, good boy. You guys are boring. Hi. Sup, bro. Sup, bro. Sup, bro. Oh, let's show the YouTube trick. Come here. Come here, come here. Yeah! Come here, come here! Yeah!